Hi guys, it's Dr. Veronica Vax, and today I am going to talk about one more possible uh, cause of acid reflex, type A personality. The reason I decided to answer this question because one of my subscribers wrote to me and he said, hey, listen, I saw you, saw your video here, eight most common causes of acid reflex and GERD. I think my problem is because I'm type A personality. Could that be? And he described himself a little bit there and he said, well, I'm very impatient, I'm very fast, cannot relax, cannot meditate, don't chew my food, uh, and I cannot stay, stay still. So the answer is yes, that could be the problem. Why I said so? In our body, we have two systems. One is sympathetic nervous system and the other is parasympathetic. When the parasympathetic system is activated in our body, it means that it stimulates the digestive tract. It correlates with increased production of digestive juices, juices increased blood supply and motility. This person described himself as a person who has a prevalent sympathetic system. He is always hyper means or translate in the digestive tract means the production of juices is down, decreased blood supply and decreased motility. Let's go to the blackboard and I will explain your concept again. So here I already pre draw for us picture of digestive tract. This is the mouse with the teeth and red is sympathetic system. So sympathetic system supplies all the digestive tract and when the sympathetic system is activated that means that we have decreased production of all kinds of juices including hydrochloric acid. We have decreased production of bile from the liver and the pancreatic juices from the pancreas. When we have activated parasympathetic system, that's the time when production of hydrochloric acid goes up, motility is going from the top down and the food get digested. As a result, this food get absorbed into the bloodstream and get delivered into the, into the cells. So basically what that person has is activated sympathetic system. Food drops in and stays there for a long period of time. Valves are shut, pillarus and low esophageal sphincter. Eventually, both sphincters, pillarus and the low esophageal sphincter become tied and whatever food and a little hydrochloric acid that get produced can go out through the tight sphincter and into the esophagus and will create acid reflex. So for this person, we need to activate parasympathetic system. How we are going to do that? The first step I will do is trying to slow down the person with herbs, I will give him some supplements, GABA and melatonin, and if necessary, even the drug. But first of all, I will check his TSH, T3, T4, cortisol level, and vanilla mandelic acid in the urine. Hey guys, I decided to start coaching sessions for, for GERD. If you feel that you need me, please feel free to contact and ask me questions there. Ask me questions here. I'm here to answer all your questions. Thank you very much, guys. Bye-bye for now.